All right. New channel, new content, new whatever. But uh, first of all, thanks for checking this out. Um, so a little bit about what's going to be going on here. This is kind of more of a who I am and stuff that I like rather than what you see over on my other channel, Jaybird Customs, which if you haven't checked that out, make sure you go do that, um, which is based more on my guitar stuff, building guitars. Um, I've also thought about starting a, a, another channel for my woodworking, which is uh, Jay Garland Woodworks. But right now, this is just kind of more a personal thing, uh, something that uh, I've kind of been thinking about and some of the stuff that I want to do is kind of, you know, reviews on certain things, um, other random stuff like that. So, we're just going to kick it right off with a brand new review. And it's brand new because this is my first video. So, hopefully it's a good one. But, uh, so recently I was online typing around and stuff, um, looking at, like, beard oils and things like that. And, uh... I've been using Grim Frost a lot because, uh, well, I, I thought I liked it. Um, some of the smells on Grim Frost, not bad, not great either. Um, the one that I have right now is, is, is pretty good, it's pretty strong. But I came across uh, the Beard Struggle, and they have a ton of different scents for beard oils. And I thought, okay, well, how do I choose? Well, I went ahead and got a sample pack, I guess. A scent sampler. Um, and it came in today. So, I'm going to open this up and uh, kind of take some sniffs and let you guys know what I think. So, yeah, it's kind of cool. This is my first ever unboxing video. I felt kind of cheesy doing it, but... Anyways, so, oh, so, I just want to say, uh, real quick, pretty cool packaging as well, um, and kind of funny, it says, uh, send beard pics, you sexy bearded hunk of man meat, right there, I thought that was pretty funny, uh, the other cool thing was, it says who, uh, your order was packed by, give some little, like, you know, facts about who packed your order so i thought that was kind of cool but uh yeah we're gonna cut this open and okay first things first that's awesome i uh that's really cool so there's that's not something that i ordered they just uh, i guess threw that in to like a one of the rubber bracelet things but uh it says uh raise your swords against cancer so that's actually really awesome and it's got the beard struggle logo on there so yeah that's pretty cool uh and then oh look at this there's even more stuff cool oh nice also a uh fu cancer uh, sticker, which is cool. Got to figure out where to put that now. And uh, scent guide. What else is in here? Whoa, there's a bunch of stuff. Okay, well, enough of that. That's pretty nice. Scan for product demo and beard tips. A little QR code. So, anyway, yeah. Uh, I don't know how to open this. Oh, there it goes. Oh, ah, wow, that's pretty slick. Is that magnetic? Oh, it's magnetic and everything. That's pretty cool. So it comes with six different smells. And it tells you what the smells are, but there's also smells, uh, or the names of the smells on the bottle itself, which... Actually, a pretty nice sized bottle as well. Veneers wisdom. So, oh, here we go. Okay, so I'm glad they put this in here because now I can tell you 
uh, what this says it smells like. So this one says it's spicy and woody with top notes of jasmine and saffron, middle notes of amber, and base notes of fir resin and cedar. That's uh, great. Veneer's wisdom. All right, so yeah, checking it out. Oh, that smells pretty good. Ooh, I like that one. Okay, so far this one's my favorite. It's the first one I checked out, so it's got to be my favorite. All right. And so in here, it kind of has like these little different popular new whatever. This one didn't have anything. This one, the Sears Triumph, it says it's popular. Uh, this one says notes of cinnamon, oud, incense, and cedar with a touch of tobacco washed down with some whiskey. Man, I like that one. That one smells really good. Okay, this one's my new favorite. Yeah, I like that one. Alright, next one is also a popular one, it says. Which is the Asgardian Secret. Woodsy, intricate blend of sandalwood, vanilla, and bergamot. That's not bad. I still like the Sears Triumph a little better, but that one does smell really good. You know, these are actually pretty decent size for a sample pack. The sample pack was like 30 bucks. And there's like six of these, and they're pretty full. Well, obviously they're pretty full. They haven't been used yet. But, man, I like that one. Alright, next one. Valhalla's Gates. This one says it's zesty, yet soft. If you hear that tapping, that's uh, Raven. My, my dog, she's scratching. Okay, so Valhalla's Gates. Uh, zesty, yet soft scent. With fresh citrus and deep rose top notes, smooth amber heart notes on a base of sandalwood and vanilla. Mm. Kind of like that one too. Man, I, I, honestly, all of them so far have smelled really good. I think I'm going back to that as Sears uh, Triumph, though. Mm. That one does smell good. All right. Next one up is a new scent, it says. Alfheim's Forests. It's notes of cedarwood, leather, iris, cardamom, and musk. Capture the fantasy of the forest of Alfheim on a warm autumn night. Okay, that one I don't like. Ooh. I don't know. Maybe I do. It's definitely... I see this is weird. Because it said that Valhalla's Gates had fresh citrus, but this one smells a little more citrusy to me. The, the Alpine's Forest. It smells good, but... I don't know if I like it. I don't know. Uh, <clears throat> and the last one is Viking Storm. It says powerful yet luxurious masculine scent. Top notes of pineapple and fresh apple combined with woody heart notes and vanilla. So I, I've seen a lot of talk about this one that a lot of people say that they really like this one, so. I 
it's weird. It's a really familiar scent. It's gonna sound really weird, but it reminds me of preschool. Hmm. Okay, so. I think I need to smell these two again. Because it coming down to favorites, I think it's going to be between Valhalla's Gates and the Assyrian Triumph. So, one more time. Let's check them out. Pretty nice. Man, they're actually really close to each other, actually, too. Okay, so favorite scent so far? I don't know. <laughs> Honestly, they all smell really good. Um, they're really soft smelling. Uh, the, the 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 oil that I've been using from uh, Grim Frost is a little uh, strong, but these aren't really super strong. But they have a really really nice smell so yeah uh i haven't used them yet but as of right now i really like all of them so uh as far as a review goes i'll leave it up to you um you guys check it out if you have checked this stuff out which one is your favorite let me know in the comments below and, uh, yeah. Make sure you, uh, subscribe, all that good stuff. And, uh, let me know what you guys think. And that's it. See you guys next time.